I wanted to share with you my Rock Pi. This is a single board computer. It's x86 based, 64-bit um, Intel CPU running Windows 10. And as you can see here, it's being powered by this. This is just a cell phone, um, mobile, portable battery pack. Got it on Amazon for uh, less than $30 Canadian. So that's like $1.50 US or something. <laughs> just kidding but it is very affordable it's nice because it has a digital display so you can see what the power consumption looks like and it's USB-C as well as regular USB ports so you charge it from USB-C and then you can connect other uh, USB devices to it and it powers the computer no problem it's been running um, actually I just finished installing Windows and I'm at 99% still tons of juice left so you can see here there's it running on the TV above me because uh, my monitors are currently being used for other things. And you can see here I got a mouse and a keyboard hooked up. So there it is. I mean, there's nothing really to show you in the fact that um, it's running <laughs> and it's powered by uh, a battery pack. So this is the battery pack here. Now you can find a bunch of different ones. I chose this one because it does have the USB-C connector and that's what the Rock Pi X uses. However, if you're using um, a Latte Panda or Atomic Pi or Intel Upboard, they can be powered off of USB directly. So the USB-C may not be as relevant for you, but there it is there. You can get two different colors. Um, for some reason, it costs more to get white, but 28 bucks, not bad. This is the robot that the Rock Pi X with the battery pack will be connected to. This is a... Um, TurtleBot 3 from Robotus. And we'll be putting the Rock Pi X inside of here with the battery pack, running the LiDAR so it's fully self-contained and we can start doing some navigation. We'll probably put a camera on here too so we can do some tracking in ARC. And that's what we're gonna be using.